Good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay, people, let's get it started tonight. Welcome one more time. Today is Friday. We continue with section three in this module five at English Corporativo. Just let me, somebody writing here. Huh. Listener, listener, huh? Okay. Okay, so let's take this the first attendance tonight. Um Remember to turn on your cameras. A since a form always require cameras on during the class. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Ajet. Anadelmi Herrera Morales. Ajet. Ana Marisol Mendoza. Ajet, Ángel Alexander Guardado, Ajet, Carolina Yamilet Hernández, Not Today, Claudia Guadalupe Arias, Ok, uh, Listener, Claudia Yvette Samayoa. No. Hey. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Hilda, I cannot hear you. I cannot see you. 
Present teacher. People for the attendance, your camera must be Present on. Teacher. Okay. Irma de Los Angeles Flores. Present teacher. Jessica Rosemary Olmedo. Uh, Joana Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Karina Melissa. Present. Thank you. Karina Melissa Estrada. Present teacher. Okay, Karina, you have the personal session tonight, okay? Okay. Uh, Linda Stephanie Ramirez. Send and listener. Hey, what happened today? Too many listeners. Mayra Roxana Hernandez. Present teacher. Okay. Miguel Angel Dominguez. Present. Present teacher. Okay. Nelson Ivan Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Xiomara, not really. Uh, Olga Marleni Gomez. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, America Dominguez. Present teacher. Okay. Silvia Suleima Rodriguez. Silvio Enrique Cortés. Present. Yeah, thank you. Silvio Enrique Cortés. Present. Okay. Carlos Alberto Meléndez. Carla Verónica Suria. Present. Okay, very good. Wow. I'm here, teacher. Who? Ah, Xiomara, okay. Good. Yes, yeah, teacher. Okay, very good. Ah. <sighs> Okay, people. Let's see. Well, let me share the screen. Last night uh, we read this conversation. I phrases to describe issues. Okay. Let me read it one more time tonight. Then I will send you to practice the conversation in pairs. Uh, there are two questions about the conversation that you are going to respond. And after that, we are going to. Wow, I will read the conversation one more time just to refresh your mind about the pronunciation. Then you are going to practice in pairs. So listen. Thank you for coming, Dorian. No problem. Someone reported a fault on one of your machines. I'll have a look at it. You are right. You know, it does not work properly and it makes a strange noise. This is a complex machine, so maybe you will need some time. Yes, complex machines have a lot of components. I need to take the metal casing off to verify if it is a minor fault 
or what? I understand. If that is the case, we need to speed things up. I recommend check the brushes once a fortnight to make sure they are not down. And what happens if they are? We will have to extend the shot. Okay. Very good. Then there are two questions here. What seems to be the problem with the machine? And one recommendation does Dorian give? Okay. Read the conversation and respond these two questions. So let me... Oh, the problem is with the listeners. We have how many listeners? Let me check one more time. Who are the listeners? Linda, Claudia. Okay. Sixteen, seven groups. Oh, amazing. The two listeners are together. Good. Yeah. Okay, people, so go to your couples, to your groups, practice the conversation, respond the questions. See you in 10 minutes.
Hello, teacher. Hello. Classmates are working in groups, practicing the conversation we we started last night at the end of the class. So they are about to come back. Okay. How was your day at the hotel? It was busy. Okay. Yes. Okay, people, welcome back. I'd like to hear your, your conversations, okay? Some of you. Let me start with group number seven, which is Xiomara and Suleyma. Okay, Tisha. Okay. Very good. I'm Ramon or, or Dorian. Ramon, si usted gusta. Okay. Thanks you for coming, Dorian. No problem. Someone report a fault on one of your machine. I have a look at it. You are right. You know it does not work properly and it makes a strange noise. And it is a complex machine, so maybe you will need some time. Yes, complex machines have a lot of components. I need to take the metal casing off to vary if it is a minor fault or what. I understand. If that is the case, we need to speed things up. I recommend check the brushes once uh, for night to make sure they're not down. And what happens if they are? We will have to extend the shoot. Very good. Thank you. Now let's see Olga and Silvio. Okay. Okay, teacher. You are Ramon Silvio. It's okay. 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 Thank you for coming, Dorian. No problem. Someone reports a foul on one of your machine. I'll have a look at it. You are right. You, kn you know it does not work properly. 
and it makes a strange noise sometimes. Yes, complex machines have a lot of components to, veri to verify it is a mi minor fault or what. I understand. If that is the case, we need to speed things up. I recommend check the brushes once up for night to make sure they have to extend they the shoot. Okay, okay, very good. Thank you. You're uh, let's continue with Nelson and Senaida. I am Ramon. Okay. Thank you for coming, Dorian. No problem. Someone report a fault on one of your machine. I'll, I'll have a look, look at it. You're right. You know, it, it does not work properly and it makes a strange noise. This is a complex machine, so maybe you will need some time. Yes, complex machine have a lot of components. I need to take the metal casing off to very if it is a minor fault or what. I understand. If that is the case, we need to spend things out. I recommend check the brushes on once a fortnight. Make sure they they are not done. And what happens if they are? We will have to extend the shot. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now, um, let's see, group number one, we have Angel, Irma, and Mayra. A ver. Um, Mayra no, no, no se conectó, teacher. Okay, entonces Angel and Irma. Angel Ramón. Okay. Thank you for coming, Storia. No problem. Something report a foul on one or your machine. I have a look at it. You are right. You know, it does not work properly and it makes a trance noise. This is a complex machine. So maybe you will need the sun time. Yes, complex machine has a lot of components. I need to take the metal casting or to bury it, it if it is a minor fault or what. I understand. I that is the case. We need to speed things. Then speed then so recommend the chicks these brushes once a fortnight to make sure they're not told. And what happens if they are? The need size extension to shoot. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now let's continue. There we go. Let's go. Ah, no. Uh, Joanna okay, yes, and yes, Carla. Cerrado, open, open, close. Okay. Yes, está. <coughs> okay, teacher. Thanks for coming, Dorian. No problem, someone report a fault on one of your machine. I'll have a look at it. You are right. You know it does not work properly and it may a strange noise. This is a complex machine, so maybe you will need some time. Yes, complex machines have a lot of components. I need to take the metal casing off to verify. A minor 
phone and what? I understand. If that is the case, we need to speed things up. I recommend check the brushes once per night to make sure they are not down. And what happens if they are? We will have to extend the shot. Finished. Thank you. Very good. Mm. That was your own. Uh, okay, Karina and Miguel Angel. Okay. Miguel, you can start. Okay. Empieza si gusta. Yo empiezo. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for coming, Dorian. No problem. Someone reported and followed one of your machines. It'll have a look at it. You are right. You know it does not work in probably. Probably. And it makes an extra noise. This is a complete machine, so maybe you will need some time. Yes, complex machine have a lot of components. I need to take the metal casing of the very ETC, a minor fault, or what? I understand. If what is the case, we need to speak things up. I recommend check the brushes on the four night to make sure they're not down. And what happens if they are? We will have to extend the shot. Teacher. Teacher, Hello, I'm, teacher, I'm not here. <laughs> I'm sorry, my microphone was mute. Okay, two words. I was uh, telling you about two words uh, regarding the pronunciation. One is the, the regular word report and the past form reported, reported, okay? And the other is the pronunciation of components. The stress is here. Components, okay? Not components, it's components. Um, otra palabra que les había mencionado también. I understand. Understand. No understand. No understand. I understand. Um, I recommend, I recommend, it's another one, stress is in the second E, recommend, okay, uh, basically this, well, this is not a stress, but this word is once, once a fortnight, once. Okay. Then there are two questions. What seems to be the problem with the machine? Uh -huh. According to the conversation, what seems to be the problem with the machine? What do you think? 
make what happens? A, a strange noise. Uh -huh. Not work properly. Yeah, it's not working properly and it's making a strange noise. Okay, very good. And what does Dorian recommend? Or what recommendation does Dorian give? I recommend checking the brush ah. one afternoon. Once a fortnight. Recommend the brushes or check the brushes once a fortnight. Okay, very good. Very good. Okay, so these are some phrases that we can use to describe a problem, to describe issues, okay? Issues is uh, like synonymous of problems, okay? Um, the, the phrases are, I'll have a look at it. I'll have a look at it. It doesn't work properly. It doesn't work properly. It makes a strange noise. It makes a strange noise. I need to, I need to, I need to speed things up. I need to speed things up. Check the brushes once a fortnight. Check the brushes once a fortnight. I have to extend the shot. I have to extend the shot. A minor fault. A minor fault. Okay. And we have this vocabulary. Um, okay, let's do this together. What is the meaning of extend the shot? Small, unimportant problem. Check it. A period of two weeks. Do something faster or make the shot down longer. One, two, this three, four, one, five. This is one is A. Number five. Number five. Yes. Make the shot down longer. Mm. Yes, extend the shot is make the shot down longer. Good. What is the meaning of speed things up? What is the meaning of speed things up? Something. Number. Number Please four. turn on your mic. Turn four. off your microphones. If there is, ahí se oyen conversaciones que no debemos estar escuchando. Nos distraen más a los que son chambrosos que queremos saber qué está pasando. Nos distraen. Okay, speed things up is do something faster, huh? Oh. Muy bien. Have a look at it. What is Number this? One. Check one. it. Small Number. and important problem. Mm -hmm. El second. Check it. Check it. Yes, yes. check it. Uh, Fortnite. A period of two weeks. A period of two weeks. Correct. Yes. And a minor fault. A small, unimportant problem. A small, unimportant problem. Okay? Very good. Very good. So, because this is very easy, you are going to create a conversation. Okay? Imagine of a... a problem that you may have at work okay you're going to work in pairs okay. imagine a problem and use this vocabulary these expressions to 
describe the problem and the solutions, okay? You're going to use the these expressions. Yes. And these ones as well. To in your conversation, okay? Uh, basically, from these expressions, de, de esta, del ejercicio 4, quiero que por lo menos utilicen cuatro de esas frases en la conversación que van a crear. Vean ahí cómo las meten, ¿verdad? Para que por lo menos cuatro de esas frases aparezcan en la conversación. Mínimo. Si pueden más, más. No hay problema. Mínimo four. ¿Ok? Claro. Yeah, right. Any question with the activity? Okay. Perfect. No, no, no. Okay, go to your groups, prepare the conversation. I will give you around 10 minutes and practice your conversation because you are going to present your conversation, okay? See you later. Sin asignar, vamos a ver dónde la mano. Oh. Ah, uh, 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 yes. Bien, los voy a enviar a un grupo donde están dos solo de oyentes. Y Nelson K. I have a look at I have a look at look at it. Dígame usted porque igual. Silvia, I need to help you. Oh, hey, Silvia, I need to help you. Silvia, I need to help you. Silvia, I need to help you. Estoy revisando las. Estoy revisando los que hay para poderles responder. Por eso, pero es que ahí está, mire, ahí está. I, I have a look at it. Como yo le digo, Silvia, I need, to, I need to help me. Y usted me va a decir, uh, que me, what, what, ¿qué le dije que me va a decir? I have a...
Ajá, jóvenes. Ajá, teacher, ahorita estamos viendo, eh, cada uno va a formular una, una oración y estamos viendo cómo la organizamos, pero cada uno está resolviendo para luego armarla. Ok. It's a conversation, ok. Ya, yeah, ya, yeah, teacher, la vamos a juntar para conversarla. Perfect. Right. Ah, le podemos agregar ahí después de... Yo creo que, yo, yo creo que el, el good morning sería ya con el nombre porque se cono, digamos que estamos en... Que, que ya sabe quién va a llegar. Sí, o lo ponemos al inicio como una presentación, el B. Uh -huh. Good morning, I am a, a, a technical support. Ajá. Uh -huh. and, you, and, and you call me... And you call me for help you for help eh, ajá ok entonces sería primero B sí with the, com the computer ajá ah. computer computer in the fall we need to make a strange noise Ah, aquí mismo le podemos meter otra vez. Uy, espérame. Después de my PC, coma, eh, it doesn't. It doesn't work. Properly. Properly. Y usted me puede decir. And then, you are. Uh, my computer, it doesn't work properly. Maybe. ¿Cómo se ve? My computer, it doesn't work properly. It does not not work properly. Mm -hmm. Como similar, pero cambiándole la, la estructura. Uh, thank you for coming in. In the problem, so I'm report to talk with my computer. I have a look at it. Oh, so yeah, I have a look. Okay. I have a look at I have a look at it. Look at it. Okay. Ah, sí. ¿Ya lo viste? Vaya, ahí te estoy poniendo. Vas a poner después de problem. Son su report. Hoy oh, sí. Oh, sí. Son su report. La frase que tenemos que involucrar.
Y de hecho no terminamos. Oh, ok, ok. Vamos a ver cómo van los demás. Pero voy a tomar la segunda asistencia. Y si alguien no ha terminado, me avisan. Alguien más, digo. Ok. So I'm going to take the second attendance. Alejandra Vanessa Mora. Eh, Ana Delmi Herrera. Present teacher. Eh, Ana Marisol Mendoza. Present. Ángel Alexander Guardado. Present teacher. Ah, Carolina Yamilet Hernández. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present teacher. Claudia Ivette Samayoa. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Present teacher. Irma de Los Ángeles Flores. Present teacher. Eh, Jessica Rosmery Olmedo. Joana Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Karina Melissa Estrada. Present teacher. Eh, Linda Stephanie Ramírez. Mayra Roxana Hernández. Present. Eh, Miguel Ángel Domínguez. Present. Present. Nelson Iván Alfaro. Present teacher. Olga Marlene Gómez. Present teacher. Eh, Senaida América Domínguez. Present teacher. Silvia Zuleima Rodríguez. Present teacher. Silvia Enrique Cortés. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto Meléndez. Present. Y Carla Verónica Zuria. Carla Verónica. Ok. Uh, entonces, ¿quiénes no han terminado? Mi teacher, nos falta un poquito. Irma. Los demás ya están listos. Yes, teacher. Bueno, pero sí, yes, teacher. <ríe> Bye, ok. Ahí tal vez por el WhatsApp se terminan de poner de acuerdo mientras los demás van presentando. Ok, um, let's see. Now you're going to present your conversations. Uh, uh, uh. A ver, empecemos con... Hilda, ¿con quién estaba Hilda? Hilda Xiomara. Con Silvia, teacher. Ah, qué raro que ya no me aparece aquí en el grupo, pero aquí está. Ok, sí, entonces. Se me, sí, se me fue. Xiomara and Silvia, please. Present okay. your conversation. Are you here, Silvia? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, Silvia, I need to help me. Of course. Um, what do you need? My telephone makes a strange noise. I'll have a look at it. Okay. When can you bring me the telephone? Today. Okay, I see. It's a minor fault. You need to restart it. Thanks. Okay. 
Very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. So let's continue now with uh, group number six, Karina and Miguel. Ready? Go, Karina. Okay. I need your own. Hi, Karina. What's your problem? <laughs> uh, my problem is uh, the printer it doesn't work properly. I have a look at it. Okay. It's a minute fast and check the curtain in four one days. Mm, I need to speed things up. I have to send the shot. Okay, Miguel, I'm trying to work fast in your problem. Okay, thank you. You're mm -hmm. Okay. Um, okay, very good. So look, I'll have to extend the shot, you know, no sé cómo encajaba ahí. No sé, ella me dice de que eh, tengo que chequear. Mm. Ella va a chequear el, el, The printer. La, el cartucho de la tinta. El cartucho okay. de la tinta. Ah. Check, the, check the card try in. Tengo ah. que chequear el cartucho de la, de la tinta cada 15 días. Entonces yo le digo, I need to speed it up. Ajá. Tengo que extender el cierre. Eh, te necesito acelerar las cosas, perdón. Ajá. Entonces yo le digo que necesito hacer, voy a trabajar lo más rápido posible en el Ajá. Primer. Ok. Y bueno, ok. No problem. So. Okay. Thank you. Next is uh, Olga and Silvio. Okay, teacher. Good morning. I am technical support and you call me? Yes, good morning. I have a problem with my laundry. It doesn't work properly. Okay, I have a look at it. I need to laundry my clothes and I need to my beautiful dress tonight. Don't worry, I find a fault. And it is a minor fault. Great. Thank for helping me. But you need to clean in to auto laundry twice a fortnight. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Uh, just one thing. Laundry is um, like the activity or sometimes the place where you go is not machine no well, it's, uh the machine is called washing machine oh washing uh -huh. okay. it's a washing machine okay. laundry is more the activity okay okay when you said uh i do the laundry that's basically what the Americans said, say because of do the laundry, so it's the activity. But okay, conversation was good. Okay, very good. Now let's continue with Joanna. Who is your partner, Joanna? Veronica. Veronica, yeah, no love her. I don't see her. Maybe she come back and you can present a conversation with her. Okay, let's let's wait. And then Nelson and Zenaida, please. Hello, Nelson. Hello. Thanks. Thank you for coming. Hello, Zenaida. How can I help you? I have a problem with my computer. What is the problem? 
My computer is does not properly. I think a minor fat. Okay. I will have a look at it. Um, when turn off the computer, I can't make a straight noise. I need to make a cleaning. Okay, I need to make a... Uh, um, I understand, but I need to speed, speed thing up. Well, I will have a new run memory. Thank you, Nelson. Only that teacher. Okay, no, was good. Very good. Thank you. Now let's see the group with Ana Marisol and Carlos. Okay. Okay. Thank you for coming, Anna. Um, uh, no problem. Someone report a fault on one of your computer. I will. I will have a look at it. Uh, you're right. Do you know it does not work properly. It makes a certain noise and shut down the computer. This is a whole machine, so maybe you will need some time. Yes, all computers have a lot of select components. I need to take the metal casing of the up to very verify it's a minor fault or what i understand uh if that is the case we need to speed him up i recommend you check the maintenance and cleaning one after night to make sure they're not too down uh what happens if they are you will have i think Extend the shot. Okay, do the best you can. On the, on the teacher. Okay, okay. And um, Irma and Myra. Irma and Angel. In Angel? Ah, yes. Yes. yes I, I problem in my. In your work is cash register. Um, thank you, you for coming, Angel. No problem. Angel. No problem. Someone supports a fall on, on one after cash register. You are right. Tour of Sunderland. I have a look at it. It makes a strange noise. I need time to review. How low? One, one weekend review machine. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Okay, very good. Who's writing? Oh, Veronica says that she, she doesn't have power at home. She doesn't have electricity. Okay. Um, I don't know, Joanna, you want to present the conversation alone? Yes, teacher. Okay. Veronica, thanks for coming, Joanna. Me. Okay, I need to report a fault with my PC. It doesn't work properly, Veronica. I understand. And sorry for the inconvenience. And tell me what is your problem? Me. Let me tell you, two weeks ago, my PC makes a strange noise. And I work every day 
with my PC, so I need to speed things up. Veronica, okay. Give me your full name and your telephone number. Hmm. Joana Maritza Pinson Solano. And my telephone number is 71-22-13-45. Veronica, thank you. I recommend you check the computer once a per night for what you have most information. And I have to extend the shot. Me, okay, thanks, Veronica. Thanks for calling us. Okay. Okay, very good, very good. Um, I think because uh, veo que varios, pero esa, esa expresión, extend the shot, I'll have to extend the shot. Um, tiene más que ver con parar una maquinaria, verdad, y, y dejar de dejar de usarla, ¿no? Por un periodo de tiempo, parar, parar algo, ¿no? Parar una producción. A, a eso más que todo se refiere. ¿Verdad? Eh, más que solo dejar de usar, digamos, un, una computadora, eh, o solo dejar de usar este, eh, un celular, un televisor. ¿No? Shutdown. Eh, En, en este caso, ¿no? Así. Algo industrial sería. Ya, es, es como o, o que tengas que cerrar un negocio por algo, ¿no? Vas a, a you, you need to shut, shut down the, the, the business or shut down the, 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 yeah, the, the area because the machine is not working. Um, uh -huh. So, it, it's more related to that. Muy grande. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good people. Um, nice, nice job. So understandable, se les comprende, se les entiende, ¿verdad? Lo que, lo que dicen, eso es importante. Perfect. Let's continue then with the next lesson. And we have a conversation, so let me share the screen to continue. Let me go here. Okay. Um, let's see if it's a long, a little bit longer. Okay, here it is. It's a problem. Just pay attention, listen to observe the Lasaka. Here we go. What's wrong? Well, I don't know. I have checked it. That's too bad. How about the connection? Have you checked all the cables are plugged? Yes, I have checked it too. We have not verified the rest of the computer problem with her equipment. Yeah, I heard that. Has the maintenance? They haven't. My boss sends them a memo every week. I see. By the way, the technician has this problem. Okay. Now, listen and repeat after me, please. What's wrong with the computer, George? What's wrong, wrong with, with the computer, George? Hello, Luke. Hello, Luke. Hello, Hello Luke. Luke. Well, I don't know. Well, I don't well, know. I don't, I don't know. know. Well, I have checked it everywhere and it won't turn on. I have, I have checked it. Check it. it. It won't turn on. That's too bad. How about the connection? Have you checked That's all the cables are plugged? That's, That's too bad. How about the connection? How about the connection? How about the Yes, I have. And Mario, the technician, has checked it too. Yes, I have. And Mario, the technician, has checked it too. We have not verified the rest of the computers. 
Anna we, has had the same problem with her equipment. We have yeah. not yeah. Have yeah. The very Anna has had the same problem with her equipment. Yeah, I heard that. Has the maintenance team replaced the batteries? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I have heard that. that. Has, Has the maintenance team replaced the batteries? No, they haven't. My boss sends them a memo every week. No, no they, they haven't. haven't. My boss sends them a memo every week. I see. By the way, the technician is coming. I see. By the way, the technician is coming. coming. Great. I hope he can fix this problem. Great. Great. I, I hope, hope he can, can fix, fix this problem. problem. Okay. Very good. So pay attention to these expressions or to this form. Okay. I have checked it everywhere. I have checked it everywhere. Have you checked all these cables are plugged? Uh, the technician has checked it too. And all of these we have not verified. Anna has had the same problem. Has the maintenance team replaced the batteries? So all of these forms are what we call present perfect. Present perfect. And how do we form the present perfect? Well, let me show you here. First, when are we going to use the present perfect? Well, we use the present perfect to talk about unfinished actions or states or habits that started in the past and continue to the present. Unfinished actions, this is important, okay? Unfinished actions. Habits that started in the past and continue to the present. So in those cases, we use present perfect. When we talk about unfinished actions or habits or actions that started in the past and continue to the present. Okay. Uh, use the verbs in the participle form. We are going to use the verbs in the part participle form. The past participle, past participle. And the auxiliary, what auxiliary we use for he, she, and it. Look, she has explained the team has not uh, that has not had that kind of problem. So, what is the auxiliary for he, she, and it? Has. Has correct. Okay. And what is the auxiliary with the rest? Have. Have. Yes. Have. We use has for he, she, and it, and have for the other pronouns. I, we, hmm? they. So you see here the structure. Yeah, subject plus auxiliary, our has plus verb in the past participle plus complement, okay? That is the structure for this form. So it is important to learn the past participle form of the verbs. El pasado participio. 
Son todas las formas terminadas en ado, ido, ¿verdad? Eh, básicamente, ¿no? El pasado participio. Por ejemplo, el verbo comer, comí, es el pasado simple, comido, sí, past participle. All right. So, de, con los verbos regulares, el pasado participio es fácil porque es el mismo simple past, con los verbos regulares. El mismo simple past es el past participle. ¿Verdad? Aquí tenemos algunos ejemplos de check, check. Da, eh, replace, replace. Todos estos son verbos regulares. Explain, explained. Solo es el mismo simple past. Pero en cambio, el... Bueno, este también es igual. Have, had, had. Ahora ya con los verbos irregulares, sabemos que hay muchos, la mayoría cambia completamente. ¿Verdad? Por ejemplo, comer, eat, ate, eaten. ¿Verdad? Eat, ate, eaten. Escribir, write, wrote, written. No, en nadar, swim, swam, swim. Ir, go, gone, when. No, no, go, went, gone, perdón. Go, went, gone. Y así. Es de buscarse una listita de verbos, ¿verdad? Donde estén simple past, past participle. Y no hay otra forma, los verbos eh, eh, irregulares, que de aprendérselos de memoria. No hay regla para el past participle de los verbos irregulares. No hay regla. Ah, los que terminan así, se convierten en esto. No hay. Ok, pero la estructura es esta. Veamos, I have checked the reports. Sujeto, auxiliar, past participle. They have not replaced. Y el, el negativo, simple, ¿verdad? Solo se le agrega not. Have not, has not, para el negativo. Ok. Voy a mostrarles otro cuadrito que tengo por acá. Es este. Este es el pasado. Acá está. Son algo, otros ejemplos de esto, ¿no? Veamos. A positive or affirmative. I have worked there. Negative. I have not worked there. Question, have you worked there? No. Teacher, no se ve. No se ve. Ah, oh, perdón. Vamos a compartir. Ahora. Ahora sí. Yes, sí. Ok. Uh, les decía, ¿verdad? Affirmative, I have worked there. Negative, I have not worked there. Question, have you worked there? ¿Verdad? Solo siempre cambiamos el orden acá. El auxiliar primero, después el sujeto y después el verbo. He has worked there. He has not worked there. Has he worked there? We have worked there. We have not worked there. Have we worked there? No. Este es el present perfect y sus diferentes formas. Déjenme eh, enviarles esta captura de pantalla para que lo tengan ahí. Hasta es. Ahí les queda en el WhatsApp esa captura de pantalla. 
Entonces, veamos estas oraciones acá. ¿Cómo armamos el present perfect? Bueno, Mario, change the fuse. Ok, Joana, dime. Mario has. Ok. Ya Mario has changed. Ahorita. Mario has changed the fuse. The fuse. Perfect. Very good. Now, next. The production is a negative. Uh -huh. The production have not. Uh, have or has? Has. 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 Yes, has. Has not. Has not stop stop it stop it stopped. Muy bien. Okay. Number three. Well, alguien más. Your team. Our team. Our team. Our has. Have. Um, have. Have. Yes. Everybody agrees that is have? Yes, have. Bueno, vamos a ver. Our team have box the equipment. Well, no, it's a regular verb. No, 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 no. Our, Our team, team has, has fixed. Ah, 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 Has. Ah, ¿por qué? Because is one team. Team is yeah. singular. Team is singular. Our team. Eso es singular. ¿Verdad? Aunque digan nuestro, no estamos hablando en plural. Nuestro equipo. No, es singular. Entonces, is has, no have. Okay. Number four. Somebody else? Jenny. Jenny has not. Has not. not. Has not. Budget. Budget. Uh -huh. The cart. The cart. The cart. Does not plug the cord. Number five. Secretary. Must make a focus. Have or has? Has. Has. As maker. Maker. Man, no. Made. Made. Enough copies. Has made enough copies. And the last one. The technician. Our has. 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 The connector. Has. Check the connector. Okay. What? 
any question with this? Yes, teacher, I have a question. Okay. Eh, es, ahí estaba leyendo que decía que es cosas que empecé en el pasado y siguen sucediendo en el presente. Ah. Y entonces vendría siendo como, yo empecé a cocinar. No, no. ¿Cómo, cómo es el español en esto? Ok. Mario has changed the fuse. Mario ha cambiado el fusible. Cambió. No. no. It's not Mario cambió. Ah, que lleva el, el hash. Perdón, perdón. Yes. Ha cambiado, ok. Ha perdón. cambiado. Okay. Este have y este has. Aquí si no le es... quitamos el hash, si le quitamos el hash, es así como que cambió, ¿verdad? Yes. Ok. Este have y este has, aquí no es tener. Ok. ¿Verdad? Aquí es haber. Okay. Yo he, tú has, el a, nosotros hemos, ellos han. Ok. Si quiero decir, yo he hecho la cena, sería I have made the dinner. Yes. Yes. Correct. Okay. Perfect. So that is have or has. Any other question? No, okay, let me see. I have another activities here. Uh, just let me take a look which one use. Oh. Okay. I will give you a, show you a chart. And you are going to translate these sentences into English from Spanish to English. Okay. What time is it? Uh, we have 10 minutes. Yeah, we have time. Yo no he tomado café hoy. Ella ha escrito la carta en español, no en inglés. Nosotros no hemos trabajado en tres días. Ustedes han sido nuestros mejores amigos. Bueno, el jefe no ha venido a la oficina hoy. Tú has comido mucho esta noche. Yo nunca he ido a Europa. ¿Y tú? Simple. Ok. Let me send this to WhatsApp. And then you're going to work in pay. There you have working pairs to translate from Spanish to English.
Okay, people, it is time to stop. You can finish the exercise during the weekend. Okay, and I'm going to ask you, we're going to check it on Monday, okay? So let me take the last attendance. And remember, uh, Karina, that you have the personal session tonight. Okay, I'm going to start from the bottom to the top. Carla Veronica Surya. Uh, she had problems with the power. Carlos Alberto Melendez. Present. Okay, Carlos, have a nice weekend. See you on Monday. You. Silvia Enrique Cortez. Okay, Silvio, good night. good night. See you on Monday. Silvia Suleyma Rodriguez. Present, teacher. Okay, Silvia, see you on Monday. Have a good night. Senaida America Dominguez. Present, teacher. Have a nice night. You too, Senaida. See you on Monday. Olga Marleni Gomez. Thank you, sir. Okay, Olga. See you on Monday. Have a nice weekend. Thank you. you Nelson too. Ivan Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, good night, Nelson. See you teacher, on Monday. Teacher, ya me mencionó. No, no. no. Wait. Okay. <laughs> Voy de abajo para arriba para que. Ah, okay, teacher. Sí, para que pues, todo sea justo. Miguel Ángel Domínguez. Russian, Russian. Ok, good night, Miguel Ángel. See you on Monday. Mayra See Roxana Monday. Hernández. Present teacher. Ok, good night, Mayra. See good you on night. Monday. Linda Stephanie Ramírez. Present teacher. Good night, Linda. See you on good Monday. Night. Karina sí. Melisa Estrada. Present teacher. Okay, Karina, have a good night. See you on Monday. Joana Beatriz Orellana. Present teacher. Okay, now, good night. Good night, teacher. Jessica Rosemary didn't show up today. Irma de Los Angeles Flores. Present teacher. Okay, good night, Irma. Good night, teachers. Hilda Xiomara Soriano. Present teacher. Good night, Xiomara. Good night, teacher. See you Monday. See you on Monday. Have a nice weekend. You too. Claudia oh, Ibet, Samayoa, not today. Carolina Yamilet, not today. Claudia Guadalupe Arias. Present teacher. Okay, good night. See you on Monday. See you on Monday. Angel Alexander Guardado. Angel. Present teacher. Okay, good night, Angel. See you on Monday. Ana Marisol. Good night. Mendoza. Present. Okay, good night, Marisol. See you on good Monday. Night. See you. And Ana Delmi Herrera. Present teacher. Okay, Ana Delmi. Have a nice weekend. See you on Monday. Okay. Bye, teacher. Very good. Okay, Karina. Thank you, okay, Karina, ¿hay algo que quisiera que reforcemos? Teacher, quizás a mí la parte que más me cuesta es saber en qué tiempo estamos utilizando los verbos. Mm -hmm. Porque, por ejemplo, en este tema, eh, mientras hacíamos la conversación o pasábamos a inglés las oraciones, no teníamos como claras las ideas en qué tiempo teníamos que dejar el verbo. Si vamos a utilizar el ONG, el ING, perdón, o los íbamos a, a hacer en pasado. 
En este último ejercicio. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ya. Bueno, yo les mencioné que en este, en esta forma, vamos a verlo de nuevo. En esta forma, ¿verdad? El verbo va en participio pasado. Ah, ok, ok. No le alcancé a escuchar entonces. Ok, no, no hay problema. Lo vemos ahorita de nuevo. Acá lo vimos. Vamos a regresar. Acá está. Quizá eh, esto, no sé si esto les confundió, pero lo vimos también acá en el libro. No sé si estás viendo lo del libro. Acá. La estructura del present perfect es esta, ¿verdad? Ah, ah, ah. Sujeto más el auxiliar que va a ser siempre have o has. Uh -huh. Siempre va a ser have o has. Have para I, you, we, they. Y has para he, she, it. Lo que está acá. ¿Verdad? Que completamos esto. Y que para he, she, it vamos a usar has. Llenamos acá, ¿verdad? Has para he, she, it. Y have para el resto de los pronombres. Para el resto vamos a usar have. Ahora el verbo. Es el, de, el verbo principal de la oración. Es honesto, ¿verdad? Les dije que lo vamos a usar en past participle. El past participle es lo que en español son todas las terminaciones ado, ido, ¿verdad? Comido, bebido, visitado, ¿no? leído o algo otros como escrito. ¿no? Esa, esos son los pasado participio. Y que eh, esa es la forma que tenemos que aprender. Okay. Para, sí, para el lunes les voy a enviar una lista de verbos donde están las tres columnas, ¿no? El verbo, en el, el verbo en pasado y el verbo en pasado participio. Hay que aprendérselos, ¿no? Okay. Okay. Entonces, si en el ejercicio que estábamos haciendo, vamos a ver, volvamos a este ejercicio. Así vamos a decir, yo no he tomado café. Les dije que el, el e, el ha o el has es el verbo haber, el auxiliar haber. Que es en este caso... Yo no he, ¿verdad? Vamos a escribir acá. I have not, porque es negativo. Y el participio pasado de tomar, que es drunk. Drunk. Coffee. Today. I have not drunk coffee today. ¿Eh? O sea, acá tenemos el, el auxiliar. ¿no? Have. Y el past participle. Drunk. Eh, eh, ¿Qué verbo creí? ¿En qué caso? No sé si me puedes explicar. ¿En qué caso no sabían qué verbo poner? ¿Cómo poner el verbo? Eh, vaya, en, el, en esta nosotros con el compañero 
este, no, no le pusimos el have, mm. sino que simplemente I not drunk, I not drunk coffee today y no utilizamos el, el, el have. Entonces ahí era donde teníamos como la, la duda, porque este, yo le decía que teníamos que utilizar el have, pero él no, porque él entendió de que solamente el verbo lo, lo hacíamos en pasado. No. Uh -huh. no Pero no es... me quedó claro. <risas> sí, la estructura es eso, ¿no? Porque es, es este que, es, que usamos en español. Esta forma del bar. Yo no he. Ese es el auxiliar. Ok. Esa era mi duda, Ticha. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Perfecto. Tú. Con todo lo demás estamos bien. Sí, dicho. Vaya. Qué bueno. ¿Y aquí lograron avanzar? O? Sí, sí, sí las hicimos. Ah, bueno. Solo que ahí la vamos, voy a modificar esa parte. Vaya, pues. Y lo vamos a seguir viendo el lunes, ¿verdad? Pero lo hemos comenzado a ver. Vamos a tener otras prácticas el lunes para reforzarlo más. Ok. okay Ok. Vaya pues, Karina. Have a nice weekend. Ok. Enjoy, enjoy Ban Ban. <laughs> I will Ay, go. Uh -huh. Every weekend I, I go. Bueno, no, no todo, pero. Pero me gusta. Ahí estamos, estamos trabajando en, la, en el pan de muerto. Ah, verdad. Ese nunca lo he probado, fíjate. Y el, y este, ¿cómo se llama? El, el pastel de 31 de octubre, el de Halloween. Hacen de calabaza. Sí. Ah. Hacemos pastel de calabaza. Estamos trabajando en eso. ¿Y tú estás en la producción o en administración? Sí, fíjese que estoy en la parte administrativa, pero este soy de costos. Entonces, cada producto ah. nuevo, ajá, nosotros vamos y lo costeamos. Y vemos cada receta, ¿verdad? Para ver cuál es la que... La UL, o sea, hacemos con cinco recetas y ahí vemos cuál es la que... Ah, gana. Interesante, Bien. interesante. ¿Verdad? Bien interesante. Bien interesante. <risas> Me gusta cómo ha crecido esa... En los últimos años, ¿no? Ha crecido mucho. Sí, de hecho, se va a abrir otra en San Salvador. Estos días en la San Benito. Oh, uh -huh. excelente. Sí, es que en, no, que en Lourdes tenemos dos. El encuentro y Lourdes. Sí, sí, sí. Uh -huh. Buenísimo, yo soy cliente uh -huh. de ahí. <risa> Háganme descuento. ¿eh? <risa> eh, ah, no, sí, tenían, antes tenían unas tarjetitas. Sí, sí, es cierto. Una... Excelente. Sí. Okay, Vaya, pues, Karina, have a good night. Enjoy good night, your weekend teacher. and see you on Monday, okay? See you. Bye. Bye-bye.